are made of. Oh my god, guys. Pig wings. Smoked pig shank with an apple drizzle uh, glaze. Oh. To die for. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you uh, hit the like button. Smash the uh, notification bell thing, my jigger. Last night, I went ahead and I. Uh, Brown, browned, brine, some hog shanks, pig shanks. And I am going to smoke them today and make some what they call pig wings. So here's what the, the shanks look like after they've been brined for, uh, for 20 hours or so. I'm going to use a spice that a uh, cupcake lady gave me for Christmas. It's a... Uh, Good shit from the Big Cock Ranch. We have the shanks all spiced up. They've been brined. They've been spiced. Now we're just letting them sit for another 20 minutes to get closer to room temp. I'm going to run out to the barbecue area at Base Camp Rico and uh, get the burr house cooker ready to, uh, to cook on. Okay, guys, it, it's go time. Fire in the fire pit, coffee in the coffee pot, pig wings on the cutting board, barrel house cooker, 260 degrees. It's time to put the meat on the grill and go with it. Now one of the things this barrel house cooker is designed to do is it has this H rack that you can put in there and then you it's designed to hang your meat. Okay? So that the juices all go down in the charcoal and it comes back up and it just keeps the meat going good. But it also has a grill that you can put here and I can put this meat on that grill. Hey guys, it's, uh, it's about 340 right now. As usual, I'm fighting the sun. Uh, it's, it's going down in the west fast. I don't know how long it's going to take these pig wings to cook, so I'm going to leave them on here about an hour. Come back, check them. Turn them over, cook them another hour or so, check them again. It might take three, 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 four hours, I don't know. But we're going to, we're going to try it. I'll probably hook a uh, shop light up after a while. And finish them off in the dark. So stay with me. Do me a big favor because I really appreciate you all hanging out with me and sticking with me. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't. Hit the like button, the notification bell, so you can get all my uh, my videos as I put them out there. It's been about an hour and a half. The uh, pig wings and the burrow house cooker, they've been hovering between 225 and 230 this entire time. So we're going to take our first check, our first look, and see how they look. So as you can see, they're looking pretty good. They, uh, they're they cooking up just like I want to. I flipped them. I'm going to go ahead and uh, cook them another hour, check them, take a temp, see where they're at. They might be done. I don't know. We'll figure it out as we go. Guys, it's getting, it's getting crunch time. These things are getting there. It's uh, been on two hours, two and a half, maybe three hours. I don't know. I, I lose track of time when I'm cooking. I'm, uh, I'm going to cook them a little longer than you should. I, I'm going to try to get them closer to the pulled pork um, temperature, closer up to the 200, 205. So, you know, that way I know they're tender. This is a tough piece of meat. I just want to cook the heck out of it. Now, I've never had anything come out of a smoker dry. No matter what the temp is, maybe that's just my luck. I don't know. Well, let's take a look at these and uh, see if you're excited about it as I am. All I can say, guys, is OMG. Oh, my God. Uh, these are looking good. Now, you notice the little ones are getting kind of charcoal. And that was my fault because when I when I bought these, I've never cooked them before. I went ahead and asked the butcher to cut some of them in half. 
Uh, I'm thinking that, you know, I was thinking at the point that would be better, but it's not because, of course, they're going to cook quicker than the big ones. They were at 180 degrees. I'm probably going to take them to 190 and then pull them off and let them rest. Come back here in a minute and take the small ones off. I might go inside right now and think about cooking a uh, little apple glaze or something like that for them. All right, guys, a little piece of apple. Little piece of the uh, wing. Ooh, this is good. This is Rico, the tie dye cowboy, guys. Take care. Keep on cooking, grilling, and smoking. Salutes, my friends.